Hey, and welcome to the video. Before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe so you never miss another great video like this one. Let's get into it. In this video, we're going to be talking about feral hogs. Feral hogs are a major problem in the United States, and they can cause a lot of damage to property and crops. In this video, we're going to talk about what feral hogs are, where they live, and what you can do to protect yourself and your property from them. Feral hogs are descended from domestic pigs that were released into the wild. They are now found in all 50 states, and their population is estimated to be around 6 million. Feral hogs are very adaptable animals, and they can live in a variety of habitats, including forests, swamps, and even urban areas. While feral hogs are found in all 50 states, there are some that are more common in the southeastern United States than others. The states with the highest populations of feral hogs are Alabama, Arkansas, Florida, Georgia, Louisiana, Mississippi, Missouri, North Carolina, South Carolina, and Texas. One state in particular has had more problems with wild hogs than others. For the state of Texas, it was in the 1930s when Eurasian wild boars were brought to Texas and released for hunting. They bred with free-ranging domestic animals and escapees that had adapted to the wild. However, it wasn't until the 1980s that they started to become a problem, and now they are estimated to cause more than $400 million in damages each year to local farms in the state of Texas. Though they are known to go after humans, since the year 1825, there has only been five documented fatal wild hog attacks on humans, with the last known attack being in 2019 to a 59-year-old woman in Texas. Feral hogs are omnivores, and they will eat just about anything they can find. Feral hogs are especially fond of corn, soybeans, and other crops as they can cause a lot of damage to fields while looking for their food. Feral hogs also root around in the ground, which can cause damage to soil and make it difficult to plant new crops in the fields. In addition to damaging crops, feral hogs can also be a nuisance and a danger to people. They are known to attack pets and livestock, and they can also be aggressive towards human beings. Feral hogs have also been known to carry a number of diseases that can be harmful to people and pets, and sometimes even fatal. If you live in an area where feral hogs are a problem, there are a few things you can do to protect yourself and your property. Keep your trash cans covered. Don't leave food out for pets or livestock. Trim your trees and shrubs so that feral hogs can't use them as cover. And report any sightings of feral hogs to your local wildlife agency. Here are some things to remember when it comes to feral hogs. Feral hogs are very intelligent animals and can learn to avoid traps and bait. Feral hogs can travel long distances and can quickly establish new populations in new areas. Feral hogs are a threat to native wildlife and can displace or even drive some species to extinction. And feral hogs can carry a number of diseases that are harmful to both people and pets. Here are some of our tips to help you stay safe when it comes to feral hogs. If you see a feral hog, don't approach it. Feral hogs are wild animals and can be very dangerous. If you have a pet, keep it on the leash when you're in an area where feral hogs are present. If you think you may have come in contact with a feral hog, wash your hands thoroughly with soap and water to help avoid any infection or bacteria. We hope you enjoyed learning about feral hogs and encourage you to like and subscribe if you want to see more amazing videos about animals and the world around us.